It's cinnamon time, it's cinnamon time. Good morning. Uh, welcome to day five of Vlogmas. It is the fifth today. Um, hi. Today is a dye day, that is the plan. I've got up, washed my hair, taken the beer now, and I've got some Critical Role playing, or I will be watching Critical Role, whilst I dye up some Christmas sock sets, because I asked on um, Instagram stories, made a poll, said, do you want to see some more Christmassy sock sets? And it was a resounding yes. So, that is the POA, and then, Later, I'm meeting up with Mario, and we're going to see Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. And I need to get a wriggle on. You're going to hear that a lot from me. Very disorganised. Vacation kit change, yet again. This time, it's because I've got some orders to package. There's no one address in there, so that is fine. So, I'm just going to spend the next few minutes, it's not many orders to package, but I'd rather get them done and out. Um, especially this time of year. Ooh, prayer of healing. If you ordered this, it is gonna be on your, on its way to you. Need to put a jumper on. I am very cold. Trying to get all the air out the bags. Customs labels, always a delight. That is one thing, one of many things. I'm not looking forward to about Brexit for pure selfish reasons. I hate writing customs labels. And I don't have to write them for anyone in the EU. And because some people voted for us to not be in the EU, I'm going to have to write them to everything. Probably. Who knows? Nobody actually knows what's going to happen with Brexit, so um, that's really fun and um, settling as a tiny business owner. I don't know what my future is going to be, so. But that's okay, we're not getting political. That's just my two cents on the matter. And I'm trying to keep everything down here and out of the way. Once again, dealing with people's addresses. And that is not a thing. I just want to extend a huge thanks to um, people that have said that they'd send me some lace weight scraps for little Lola so I can knit her some more clothes. In particular, Caroline of Dundonit um, and the Knitting Vicariously podcast. She's got some scraps, and so um, little Lola can have a matching jumper and hat to Caroline. Which would just be the cutest little thing in the world. Um, because, yeah. It would just would. It would just be really sweet. Right, I'm going to get on with packaging this because I'm talking bollyolics. Uh, and I will get back to you a bit later on, probably to open the Burner Blend Advent Calendar because I haven't done that yet and I promise I won't look like this all day. Just for some of it. You need to give your skin a break sometimes, you know? It needs the rest. It's time to open the Burn and Blend Advent Calendar. Day five. There it is, down here. Ah, oh, just a normal cup of tea. Great British cuppa, a house blend. The classic English breakfast tea. Trust us, 
brew this one for at least four minutes. I trust you. So it's an Indian Assam black tea, Ceylon black tea, and Chinese Yunnan black tea. And I will probably have this now, because I haven't had a tea yet today, and it's gone 11. So I need to fix it. Tea time. Tea time. So I just got a little knock at the door, and I got a parcel. Um, it, it is, I'm pretty sure, it is my, um, I did the Holiday Beaver from Yarnistry. So um, she has this thing, it's like a gumball machine, but she, it's stitch markers and yarns. And I decided to treat myself because it's Christmas. And I've opened the tape, but I haven't actually looked at it. But it is here. How exciting. Again, open it. Oh, it's wrapped up anyway. Yes, it's my Holiday Beaver. Ooh. Oh, how pretty! So I watched the, um, she did a live stream on Instagram where she went through and drew everyone's names and numbers. I was number 167, so I was watching it for a while. But I'm so excited. So I got a skein of yarn by Hey J Hand Dyed Yarns. This is in the colour Fuchsia, um, and it's on her 8020 Super. Uh, BFL and nylon 365 meters per hundred grams high twist sock yarn so that is what it looks like it was a mystery to me before I got it so very exciting I also got some stitch markers from Yarnistry I got two dinosaurs I already have two dinosaurs but now I've got two more I've got a lab coat so that's pretty cool and I've got a beaver and the colour of the beaver indicated, because indicated what dyer you got. It's a very organised system, I'm very impressed. I also got a hat sticker from, I want to say Rock and Molly. I got a little temporary tattoo because um, it was also for a pattern. And I got a pattern by Verity of Truly Hooked, which I'm not going to flash this too close because it's got a code on it. Oh, the code's on the back. Okay, that's fine. I'll just do this thing from Truly Hooked so I can um, go and get a crochet pattern from her I'm thinking but the the um, machine that the patterns came out of came with a bunch of tattoos so that's why we got tattoos with it and then I also got I'm so glad I got this a tiny little notions pouch from the little grey girl with beavers all over it oh, I'm so excited that I've got this Super excited. Yay! Thanks, Emma. Love it. Makeup is done. It is on the face. I look slightly less dead now. It is one o'clock. I have about an hour until I have to leave, so I guess I'm going to be doing more dyeing because it's the dye day. I'm already having to repeat Christmas jumpers. I have a navy blue one, but I've got black jeans on, so you can't wear navy in black. Anyway, um, I just want to say thank you for all the positive feedback I had on my makeup tutorial yesterday. I was worried about how it would go down, but it seems to have been well received, so thank you very much for that. Um, as you can see, I tend to wear a lot of makeup on a day-to-day -day basis. I have done for many years. I've gone heavy on the eyeshadow. My day look is very much an evening look for, for a lot of people, which you can only imagine what my evening looks are like. Um, maybe you'll probably see one at some point during Vlogmas. The joys, the sad part, let's get serious and not sarcastic. One of the sad parts about being self-employed is you don't get a Christmas party. People yesterday, yeah, blah, blah, blah. people last night were talking about, you know, oh, when's your work Christmas party, blah, blah, blah. I don't get a work Christmas party this year. Because I work by myself. How sad. 
but we are going out on a D&D night next Friday, so I still get to have a Christmas party, even if it's not like a work Christmas party, but that's okay. Right, I'm just waiting for this dye to exhaust. I've been sent, um, Becky had called out for some hat test knitters for her new hat pattern, and I have responded, and I was chosen. I mean, she'd be cruel to not choose me, seeing as we are BFFs. But this is the yarn I'm using. This was the £3.30 ball of bargain wool that I got. Pure wool superwash worsted. Um, and I gotta do a swatch. And I hate swatching in the round. Anyone else hate swatching in the round? It just feels so clunky and awkward. I hate swatching in the round. But I'm doing it for you, Becky. I'm doing it for you. It's cinema time, it's cinema time. We're off to see, that's not my face, um, Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. Because we haven't seen it, so we don't know where to find them. I mean, we've seen the first one, so I guess we know where to find those ones, but going to see Grindelwald, which is probably not pronounced like that, um, unless you're watching the German version. And then it probably is pronounced like that. First of all, I'm going to go to the post office, post these orders that I packaged up earlier today. And I get the bus because I've just missed one, so that's really annoying. <laughs> yeah, ah. We're back home now, reunited with my camera. It's annoying because I left the house with it and then thought I'd left my headphones at home then came back to look for my headphones but I hadn't left my headphones at home. My headphones were in my backpack and then when I left the house again, I forgot my camera. But hopefully the uh, video quality isn't too awful on my phone. We are going to find out in editing, Hannah. We'll already know this. Time to open up in calendars. Beep, beep, beep. It's your time to get to your turn to get closed. Okay, there's another joke. Cheddar! Again. It's already repeating them. Joke. Ready. I'm not trying to not read the joke, so I'm what not gonna write. Happened... <laughs> <laughs> what happened when the cheese factory exploded? There was lots of debris. Essentially, debris went everywhere. Get it? Debris. Yeah. Brie. The brie. The brie. Yeah, I got it. I I'm I guessed it. Advent in time. And um, Mario, what did you think of the film? I really liked. It. Nobody else to hear that at all. Ooh, a tiny. Father Christmas stamp, give me your hand. No, I just had a shit in one. Stamp it on your paper. No, you told me I have to keep it pristine. And some Merry Christmas washi tape that can be put on your orders. And then another little chocolate gingerbread man, which I'm going to keep out on hand. Thanks, Angel. It's okay. Bleep. What did you think of the film? I thought it was really good. Yeah? Highlights? Mm. I like the big cat thing with long legs. Not the little, not the little black cats, but the big one with the long fluffy tail. It was quite serious. It was quite, it was quite sinister, much darker than we thought it was going to be. Mm. But it was still really good. And then we went and got burritos and they were really tasty. Because we love burritos. Yeah. We're, we're burritos. Terrible. Okay, let's watch Master Chef. Okay. And that's probably where I'm going to call it a day for today. I've just cast off the second mitt, now, 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 blah, 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 knitting the thumb. And then they can be blocked. I'm very tired today. Oh, I feel like I've been much more lower energy, which is why I haven't filmed as much. But a bit of a shorter vlog for you today. Mario and I really enjoyed Fantastic Beasts, I think we've already said. Um, it's much darker than the first one is. Um, but still really enjoyed it and yeah I think that's everything I have to say I'm very tired 
and I don't know why. But it's only quarter past eight, so I still have time to edit this. So I'll edit this video and get it up for you. And I will see you all tomorrow for day six of Vlogmas. Bye.